Divers have now recovered four bodies from the sinking of a luxury yacht off the coast of Sicily. Search and rescue divers resumed scouring the wreckage Wednesday for the third day of looking for signs of the six missing people, including British tech magnate Mike Lynch and Morgan Stanley International Chairman Jonathan Bloomer. The first body recovered Monday was that of the ship's chef, Canadian-born Ricardo Thomas. The 56-meter-long super yacht, which is owned by Lynch's wife, capsized in a fierce storm early Monday. It was carrying 22 passengers and crew. Rick was a, a free spirit, you know. Um, he had a very beautiful soul, and I'm sure you would have seen some of the some of the, 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 the tributes and accolades that were bestowed on him on, on the social media platform because he would have touched a lot of people. Obviously, it was a, quite a shock to us because Rick has traveled the world doing what he does. Um, he's been around um, on, on many boats, uh, private boats, as a, as a chef, um, initially as a cook. And, um, you know, this, this unfortunate situation um, has rattled up. The whole incident is, I think, unprecedented. I think that's true to say of something of that scale. That's a very big uh, yacht. Totally speculation, but my take on this type of thing, why would a mast break at anchor with no sails up? That could be something like the wind was so strong that it caused vibration in the uh, rigging, which sets up what we call harmonics, which is a very particular vibration that could either have put the mast out of straight column or broke a one of the fittings on one of the wires, one of the shrouds that support the mast. And it only takes one of these pins or fittings to break, and then the mast becomes unsupported and falls over the side. Boats sink because they're flooded. You know, they fill with water. That's the only way that thing could go down is was a massive flooding um, situation. And if you look at the boat, you know, I saw pictures of it. And very big glass side windows on the pilot house, uh, which if that boat was smashed to the water very hard, those windows could have uh, given way. And you've got immediately an enormous hole in the side of the boat with water pouring in like a waterfall.